Good morning, everyone. Grayson is here eating his breakfast. Can you say good morning? Good morning. Good morning. He's having some milk, banana, and some pancakes. Pancakes are usually my go-to. They're just easy. You pop them in the microwave for 30 seconds, and they're done. And water. And, oh yes, and you have water, that's right. And Porter, Por and a fork, yes. And Porter is over here. He is in his bouncer. Hi, Porter. Hey, buddy. He has found his fingers, you guys. And he is sucking away at them. Hi, Bubba. He seems to like his um, pointer finger and his middle finger, these two. Um, Gray likes to do, this is hard for me to do. Gray likes to do these two, um, but Porter seems to be doing these two right now. So we'll see what he sticks with. Hi, Bubba. So you have to excuse my appearance. Um, I just woke up, so I'm looking a little scary. But I am finally vlogging back on the new camera because I've got all my new stuff. I've got my little tripod thing that I'm holding right now, so hopefully the camera is a little less shaky. I feel like it's a little off, like I'm diagonal. I don't know, is that better? I don't know, I'll have to figure it out. Anyway, um, yes, I got the new tripod for the camera so I can just set it down and record. And then also, I got a new memory card so it has, instead of a 32 gigabyte, I think it's like a 256. So I should be able to record lots of vlogs before I have to edit them, which is good because I get a little lazy and I wait till the last second to edit vlogs. So those are all exciting. Lots of new things have been happening really just within the past day. Um, Porter has graduated from the bassinet to the crib. Um, I thought he would stay in the bassinet a lot longer because he isn't flipping or rolling yet. Well, he wasn't till last night. More on that later. Grayson's eating behind me. And Porter's starting to get angry, so I might not have a lot of time to film this clip. But Porter has become such a light sleeper lately that it was just getting ridiculous. Anytime we would even like roll over in our bed, he would wake up and start crying, it felt like. And so I just made the decision, spur of the moment really, last night to put him in the crib all night instead of the bassinet and maybe that would help. He's still waking up like every two hours at night like a newborn and it's just killing me. So I moved him to the crib. It was way better for me, but for Porter, I mean, he didn't act any different, but he did still get up a ton of times, which I'm not expecting a miracle night one but hopefully over time it will help um i did have to go to his room several times i think maybe three times last night and of course i can't just get him on the side of the bed i had to actually get up and walk over to his room but he did okay and um so hopefully it does better also starting tomorrow he turns four months tomorrow and so i'm going to start him on baby cereal tomorrow and so i'm hoping that will help fatten him up more and just get him to sustain on you know not eating through the night I mean he's done it before he used to sleep through the night consistently and then it just stopped so I'm hoping that will help we start that tomorrow I will definitely vlog that don't you worry yeah so I put him in this crib he woke up a few times whatever well last night I had him swaddle because he hasn't been rolling he rolled twice last night onto his belly which is a no-no if you're swaddling arms. So, unfortunately, starting today, I have to stop swaddling his arms. It's a bummer because I remember with Grayson when I did that with him, I did this same thing and quit cold turkey and Grayson did not do well with the transition. It took him a while to get used to it. And so I'm thinking that's what's gonna happen with Porter. So I'm not expecting a lot of sleep out of him, but it's for his safety, so I don't want him to get hurt so unfortunately that's just what we're gonna have to do so yeah tons of things happening like I said he turns four months old tomorrow so I just feel like everything's going on on top of all the things with Porter the big thing with Grayson which is kind of why I'm vlogging today because it's a big milestone I feel like maybe not so big but 
I have this envelope here. I don't know if you can read that. Preschool registration. Yes, today I am registering this guy for preschool. Um, I have until January like 21st to do it, um, but Anthony's home from work today, so I'm gonna go and take advantage of it when both boys are napping at the same time. Hopefully I can get them to nap at the same time. That's always a fee as well. But anyway, I'm gonna run it out and drop it off so that he's officially registered, um, and then hopefully he gets accepted. It's ridiculous, we have to pay a $100 registration fee. Is that how it is at preschools where you're from? I had no idea we had to pay a registration fee, but we do. So, <laughs> yes, we are excited for Grayson to start preschool. I think he's gonna do amazing. I honestly wish I could put him in right now because with Corona and it being freezing outside, we're just kind of stuck in the house constantly and so I feel bad for him, like he's bored. So I'm super excited for him to start next year. Um, I've also been looking into soccer for him. I think he's gonna start in the fall because they start at age three and he will turn three in April. So just a lot of new things happening with Grayson and then a lot of new things happening with Porter too. So I'll try to vlog a little bit today and try to get some of Porter's you know, new things that he's doing. Anthony is laughing at something. I've got Porter here with me. Why, why do they shorten it? Why do they shorten their name to BBW? Anthony is looking at um, Bath and Body Works and they shorten it to BBW. Google it if you don't know why that's funny. Don't Google it. Don't Google it at work. Please don't, just don't. Don't Google it, I guess. Anyway, I have Porter here. He's very sad today. Say hi, Porter. We just did his first nap. Oh, oh, where he, yeah, where he wasn't swaddled. And it was terrible. He cried, he barely slept. He does not like his arms not being swaddled in. So we're in for a tough couple days, unfortunately. But I had to get that video of Gray. He's just so cute. He's just sitting there singing his songs. Um, I got that Elmo book and it's got a little CD player on it and it plays nursery songs and he loves it. Say hi. You see the baby? <laughs> His face is changing, don't you guys think? And Anthony's here. Say hi, Anthony. Mm -hmm. We're just staying busy, but yeah, Gray's singing. I'm gonna get more of him singing because he's just so cute. Oh. Girl, I chance to meet. Hi ho, hi ho, hi ho. Riggedy Jake, and away we go. Away we go. Away we go. Riggedy Jake, and away we go. Hi ho, hi ho, hi ho. Oh, south to sissy, my sow singing Polly Wally Doodle all the day. My sow, she is a spunky gal singing Polly Wally Doodle all the day. Pretty well. Fare thee well, fare thee well, my fairy fay. For I'm going to Louisiana just to see my Susiana singing Polly Wally Doodle all the day. Yeah! What is that? It's costumes. What is that? A dress. What is that? Grayson is asking what everything is lately. That's his new thing, is he wants to know what everything is. He points what everything is and wants to know. Sesame Street. Sesame Street. That's right. 
Also, Gray is still obsessed with wearing his dinosaur boots. And usually he has his um, dinosaur shark hat on. I don't know what happened to it, but usually he's wearing that too. So we are out here. It is 44 degrees today. It's the warmest it's gonna get in a long time. After today, it's gonna be 30s, 20s. It's just gonna be cold. So we're enjoying the slightly warm weather. I wouldn't really call this warm. Anything below 50 is not warm, but. Allison and Dakota came over this weekend and they left Dakota's ball here. So Grayson is enjoying it. I'll have to give that back to them, huh? I went and dropped off Grayson's paper registration for preschool. I meant to record myself like dropping it off, but then I was like, this is kind of silly, so I didn't. <laughs> but anyway, yes, I went and dropped it off, so now we just have to wait like two weeks to hear if he gets in or not. I'm pretty sure he will, but it's very exciting. And Porter is down for his third nap of the day. Um, he's been taking really small naps because he's not swaddled, his arms aren't swaddled, so he's not used to it. Um, he's getting better as the day goes on. Uh, I don't know if it's because he's more tired or he's just getting used to it, but like the first time I put him down, he cried off and on the whole nap. I don't think he really slept at all. And now this nap, the third nap, he only cried maybe like a minute and then he fell asleep. So it's definitely getting better. Um, I'm a little worried about how tonight's gonna go. I remember when we did this with Grayson, I was up like every hour with him. So I'm not planning on getting a lot of sleep tonight, which stinks because I'm just exhausted as is because I'm not getting that much sleep. Porter's already waking up a ton, but such is the life of parenthood, I guess. So hopefully it goes okay, but yes, Grayson is registered and now we just have to wait to hear if he gets accepted <laughs> um i'm so excited for him to go to preschool i think he's gonna love it um and it was really hard to choose a preschool because columbus has a million preschools so i think i picked a good one but i'm sure they're all good in their own ways you know so that's the exciting news and yeah we're just gonna close out the day i'm making dinner in the crock pot i found this website it's called the magical slow cooker you should check it out if you are in need of like some new recipes they're all um, crock pot recipes hence slow cooker and we have had like five or six of them so far and we have yet to find one that a recipe that we don't like we have liked them all so far so tonight i'm making philly cheesesteaks um so i've been roasting um, pot roast um, cooking it I guess in the slow cooker um, since this morning so hopefully it turns out well um, I've never had Philly cheesesteak before I'm not sure that I'm really gonna care for it but I think Anthony will like it so that is our dinner tonight so yeah we're just hanging out Grayson is going to the neighbor's yard like he always does bring the ball back over here gray having fun with the soccer ball <laughs> which I am gonna get him registered in soccer for the fall I said that earlier but I'm excited for that yay good job buddy oh oh, oh yeah we gotta go around <laughs> his little hat I can't you guys